and the tour just about to kick off. Stuart Barnes will be anxious for a first big game to relaunch his test challenge. Good high hanging kick. Graham Dorr carries it on. Well, Carly, just what the doctor ordered. And it was great from the start. Graham Dorr came right in off the deflection. And now uh, a mistake by Orange Free State is exactly how you'd want to start the first game. So give us a chance to see how this totally new combination, remember a lot of these players are totally new to the England first team setup. Steve Bate waiting at the back as Dean Ryan, the captain, controls it and tries to get the push on. They've got the nudge, they've held it nice and strongly. Barnes hammering in from the pullback position. Stuart Barnes taking the kicking and straight and true through the middle. First points to England and first blood to Stuart Barnes. Rob Andrew looking on anxiously. Four-man line-out, Poole at the front, Bayfield in the middle. He leaps, two-handed deflection. Barnes, but they're pushing it wide this time. Hull in, just stabs it through for Adebayo. Totally missed by the Free State defenders. And it's a five-metre scrum. It's essential that that young front row holds tight. And a straight-through run, a big run there from uh, Steve Ajomo tackled he's gone to floor he had no support and the referee obviously thinks the ball hasn't got a chance of coming for a moment it looked as if he was going to go through everything that explosive pace of steve ajomo england with the ball and wait goes again he's almost through just a foot or two short and england must have this one or just picked up in the middle of the ball bayfield Gathering it in and trying to get it a long way down for the big man. And really, they made a mess of that. To the back again, Dean Ryan. That time, though, Kluta got a hand to it. They came Martens, Lover. And a little chance now for from Rensberg, the winger. And they're just batting the ball around, trying to keep it going. Penta. Through comes from Solomons. Penta the centre. Now in around the scrum. Smith, Lubber. And Pawson getting in there, getting his pass away. They're keeping it going well. It's a great little pass. That's what they were looking for. They just kept that ball going. Only Stuart Barnes's second chance. The first one after just a couple of minutes and he converted that to give them the lead. Can he get it back again? Yes, it's a great kick from Barnes. Dean Ryan getting round there to make the tackle. Also got the ball. Katz and he, time he was charged down. Barnes very aware. And Hull squirming his way out of trouble there. My goodness, he did well. Graham Roundtree just caught napping at the front, waiting for the line-out to settle, and they took the quick throw. Venter through the middle to the other Venter. The space here on the white. And it's a great little move. And the touch judge says it wasn't in touch. So that's another try, Chris Baddenhorst. <laughs> Engel at last putting one together. <laughs> Big interception. Going all the way under the pot. The substitute, Jaco Kutsia, scoring. Decides to have a go. Gets through one. He's got support. Tony Underwood, out it comes to Ojomo. Paul Hull again, he's got the overlap. Hopley and Damien Hopley at last gets a try for England. A really good concerted attack at last.
That's a great way to finish the game for a, for a young side. They've been very close, as I said before. They put runners in, and they've just struggled for not knowing each other. But I'm delighted that they finished like that. A great try, some lovely work from Paul Ho, and great support from uh, Steve Ajomo and Damon Hopley. Well, I said right from the start, I was delighted with this young lad, Paul Sun's selection. He's a very, very exciting player. And he split them right down the middle. And he was there at the end to give Damien Hopley the scoring pass.